a little sneak peek at the front end. Oh, <gasps> yeah, it's a 3.5 with a winch in it. How do we do that? So many of you probably already know you can get a full race intercooler kit to replace the factory intercooler. And that'll clear enough room to put a winch inside the factory bumper. This is a great kit and it's plug and play, but I could not handle that price tag. So I went over to eBay and I came up with what I'm calling the half race kit. Now I'm not a big fan of chrome either, so I'll be replacing the factory grill as well as sanding and painting the factory bumper cover. So first things first, I had to pull the factory bumper and prep it for sanding and painting. The center section. This isn't. This isn't going back. So, um, but just bending the clips on this should fall right out. And it did. Let's see if I can find the adapter for my impact. Just a bit too long. Ugh. They got them in behind the fog lamp housing. And of course that's a different size, probably like an eight. Bruh, you're killing me. Yeah, you made it an eight, you did. You did, Ford. You couldn't help yourself. You put tens, 36 tens across the bottom of here and then you put an eight. All right, that wasn't as bad as I thought it would be. Hello. Did you go for a walk? Um, your dad just went to go get some sandwiches. If you want to call him, he can probably pick up. Daddy, baby water. Daddy, baby water. Do you want that one? Yeah. Okay, that can be yours. It's water. Yes, yeah, Aubrey. Aubrey's on side. It's chilly. Okay, we're going to see if you'll take a nap. No, okay. No, I'm fine might be her favorite phrase. All right, we got the uh, bumper skin down to just the metal. And then we're just gonna snan, snand, sand the snots, or snand the uh, outer surface. Well, I got this on here still. So. Look at this witchcraft. All these like pop things and scary looking whatchamacallisms. Yeah, definitely not doing that right. Just like pulling a tooth. I have a suspicious feeling these may not find their way back onto the bumper. This thing's got two different, that's oddly easy, um, two different types of clips on it.
There's a right way, and then there's a way. Now we're down to just the bumper. more or less dry so still got more work to do uh, getting the intercooler hooked up probably leave this off until after that Just... actually I have no idea if that actually saves any room well I'm gonna have to put it inside and let it dry it's a little tacky I'm getting at is I don't know what it does, so I'm taking it off. Who put a winch in here? Who's idea is it? Just probably blow a coupling off before uh, I ever make enough boost to cause a problem. <laughs> 